Hi. I'm Prince. So what seems to be the problem? Oh, how rude of me. I haven't given you enough time to freak out yet. You may do so now. Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> you know, at, at the heart of the matter, though, is the music. You know, I, I am a musician. Um, I don't sample, <laughs> you know. Uh, it's not Memorex. I go on stage and my microphone is on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? what? Speaking of sampling. Well, this, is, this is history in the making because all those years you've been out there, we've been, we never heard you speak. We would just listen to the music. We see you walk by. And now, I mean, this year, this last couple of years, you just, I don't know if it's the marriage. Because they say, you know, when you get married to a woman, calm down. Okay, girl. So I don't know if it's being married or where you're at. you at. Maybe because being free too, where you, where you, where you got your own labels, you're running everything, you're in control of your life. You're just happy. Well, really, I don't talk because my voice is <laughs> And the image award goes to... Halle Berry. Thank you. This couldn't be more amazing to win an Image Award, but to be, have it be handed to you by Prince. I've only loved him my whole life, so thank you, Prince, for honoring me tonight, and thank you um, so much to the NAAC. Hypothetically, you would win in a fist fight. You or Michael Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> You're both roughly, you know, the same size, you know, you have the both, both have the high pitched sound, you know. What do your right right hooks like? Oh my goodness. He's a plant, y'all. <laughs> but I plant him. Yeah, keep it light, keep it light. How about this? Michael's not a fighter, he's a lover. <laughs> Can I, can I just say something? I've never really uh, spoke publicly about Michael. It, we should all just kind of like chill because it's, you know, he may know something none of us really know. And just like, well, let's wait and see. Let's wait it out. You know, let's just wait it out. You never know, right? You just never know. Ultimately, we all got to come back home. So let's just make a home for everybody. I had a discussion with my guitar player recently about using swear words and I know that I respect my wife to the point where I don't use swear words around her but yet and still when I get around these two <laughs> we, we start slipping see so <laughs> that's right hey Prince could you could you just say Sherry I love you thank you Sherry I love you <laughs> Breakfast yet, so. Can I have your gloves? Can I no, have your gloves? No, he didn't. He, he's. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand, Prince. You. I have what? wanted to make love Shut to you for my whole life. Hey, my name is Jason. I'm from Toronto, and I just wanted to ask Prince what is his version of real music. Do you have a concert ticket? <laughs> no. That that's that's not nice. That's that's narcissistic and. 
arrogant. It's just, come to the concert. <laughs> Not so much, no. What do you think of them, though? What do you think of Justin Bieber and Lady Gaga and the new people? Well, different strokes for different folks. Right. I, um, I make music, so I don't watch it too much. I see. Well, you know, you do make... Thanks, Charles. You want to know why you can't tell that nice dude you love him? I want to say it, but... You're scared. Exactly. If you say it and things don't work out, what then? I really care for him, and I'm just worried I'm going to lose him. That's stupid. You're stupid. I forgive you. Oh, my God, thank God. Besides, anything beautiful is worth getting hurt for. Well, it's very well put. You know who said that? No. Me. You're good. God. I wish I were more like you, Prince. Finish your pancake. Let's get to work. Oh, it's really good, but I'm um, super full. Pancake. Okay. When you call him, what do you call him? When I met him, I didn't call him Prince. I never called him that, because I didn't see him as that person. Called she him. slipped out of that, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, what do I call him? I never, I, I just talk to him. You know, people always say, well, but what if you, you need him to bring you something, That's pass right. a tea or something? She I just said, say, you say, hey. 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 He says, hey. <laughs> so you just go around the house, you, so you never call him, you never, you never slip and say. Because I never did. Because you never did call him. So it's not a. Hey, a you. big issue for me is it's, hey. <laughs> Man, I would drop, I would drop the tea if I heard Prince come from the kitchen. I'd... Would you really? Oh, man, scare me to death. <laughs> Does he make you laugh? Oh, yeah. Is he fun? Yeah. No, I'm not. Does he tell yes, jokes? Yes, you are. <laughs> yeah. I don't tell jokes. I'm serious. Yeah. <laughs> no. Really? I have chosen to use the word artichoke instead. If I can stop swearing, everybody can stop swearing. <laughs> I like that. If you have a mishap in the middle of the night, if you kick the edge of your bed, what, what do you yell? Mm, artichoke. <laughs> <laughs> there's something about, it's almost like, there's something about the forum and Madison Square Garden and things that remain, the, the soul remains in places like that. I love that you're, in keeping it real, as you have by, chosen the, by choosing the forum, also tickets the majority of tickets are $25. So, on, on, behalf, on behalf of the Latino community, I'd like to say thank you. <laughs> Wait a minute. We can eat, and we can drink, and we can see Prince for $25. You is a very mysterious man. You don't do a lot of interviews. You're very sweet, but you're very much to yourself. Okay. And ch shy? Mm, I wouldn't say okay. shy. Okay. So, I mean, when you go on stage, you're a different person. So, but off stage, you're very quiet and very mysterious. What is that all about? I'm just that way around you. <laughs> well, <laughs> what good it was so. But it's interesting because on stage it's all out there, and privately you're a very modest man. Mm -hmm. Or quiet. Uh, uh, I have my quiet moments. This is one of them. It sounds like you've grown. Uh, no, I'm pretty much the same size. <laughs> you know. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I really do feel I have. Uh... That I want to ask you about, and I did what I have never done before, which is to actually print these lyrics out. Some of them, I'm, 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 since the record is so new, I'm learning some of them. I got, got some of them memorized. Um, who, it, who gave you the lyrics, though? I've seen some really strange rewrites of my yeah. stuff. Well, I've I'm, seen one time they uh, said, uh, the lyrics to When Doves Cry was, uh, dig if you will the picture of me, Marvin Gaye, and the kids. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> well, you and know there, what? And then there was another one. <coughs> this person will go unnamed. Yes. Um, she didn't speak the English language too good. Right. Uh, she had a really cute daughter, so that's why we was acquaintances. Yeah. <laughs> but she swore up and down, <laughs> little red Corvette was pay the rent, collect. Yeah. <laughs> and gets a firm grip of life and death, then they fully understand both. For example, you, you had how many birthdays? Me? What do you think? Well, I know that you had one birthday. Yeah. When you were was born yeah. on a certain day. Absolutely. You had no more birthdays after that. So I don't celebrate birthdays, so that stops me from counting days, which stops me from counting time, which allows me to still look the same as I did ten years ago, <laughs> just like that lady did. Remember those? <laughs> Albums still matter. Like books and black lives, albums still matter. Now you want to ask me something. I get this. He wants to ask you something. What was it you want to... Uh, Jay, uh, Hel Helga told me to call, uh, to check your seat. Is it swiveling all right there? You were supposed to uh, give me a call. Oh, oh, I, oh, all right, all right, all right. Was that... Gotcha, this is buddy. so stupid. I'm down here in the middle of rehearsal. I, we're rehearsing and I get this phone call. Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, Jay, this is... What was it? Bill the head carpenter. Yeah, right. And I go, yeah, we're coming up to fix your seat. I said, what? Fix your seat. Yeah, your assistant said your seat. I go, who is, what? No, he I don't got, know. He got mad, too. And I go, he got what, real what? mad. <laughs> he wasn't even having it. Okay. Yeah, you did. Come on now. He cut me off everything. <laughs> your ass is mine. <laughs> somewhere. Somewhere. No, somewhere. Somewhere. You, you'll be in Bangkok. You'll be somewhere. <laughs> Something will happen, and you'll go, I shouldn't have done Jay. Right. Like, is this a big thing? Are you like a big practical joke? Oh, I love it. Oh, yeah. Now, yeah, now, what was it you did to Larry Fishburne? I heard something. Oh, uh, Lawrence Fishburne, um, he's in uh, Matrix. Y'all know that movie? Yeah. <laughs> I, I really dug that movie, and I, uh, I know him real well. And he came to see us in Oakland, and he wanted tickets. And I said, well, I'll give you tickets if you tell me the plot to the movie. <laughs> so the plot goes... <laughs> He's under contract, so he couldn't, he couldn't, uh, he wouldn't divulge tell it, no. So, I put him in the nosebleed seats way up. <laughs> Now, did he show up thinking he's gonna impress his friend? Oh, yeah. He <laughs> brought, brought his fiance and everything. He's getting oh, ready to chill and just check out the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, you see, someday you're gonna wake up naked, chained to a street like, well, what happened? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Now, what is, what did you tell me? Oh, I, I had Bill Maher the other night. You told me you, you, you enjoy his show, too, Politically yeah. Incorrect. You like arguing? Now, see, you don't seem like no, an no, arguing no, no, no. kind of guy. I don't like to argue, but I like uh, open discussions. Yeah. I like the unedited nature of the show. Yeah, yeah. And they, uh, last night was interesting. They were talking about war and uh, uh, why there shouldn't be any. Yeah. You know? So it was, it was interesting. I mean, you like to speak your mind. What do you want to speak? What do you want to talk about? Is something you want to speak your mind about tonight? I want to know if you wanted to get your chair. Right. <laughs> no, no, you know, all right. I am going to work I, on something. I, I will have my man, people working heard with He was their so people. mad. How'd you get this number? How'd you get this number? Aren't, <laughs> aren't. <laughs> Artists, with all due respect, contracts, protective measures. I mean, you don't, you may not go into a situation expecting someone to play you or to diss you or to act a fool in the process. But if, in fact, that does happen, how then does the artist, for example, protect himself even? Well, I can't be played. Uh, a person trying to play me plays themselves. Do you still have the same firm belief in reincarnation? <laughs> Since you don't count days and don't count birthdays? Do you still have the firm belief in not wearing ties? Yeah. <laughs> I saw you coming in, because normally I'm wearing a tie. Really? Yeah. All right. But you look so great that I thought, well, this is the most modern thing I'm having. You, you, you look sharp. You yeah, look thank sharp. you. I'll take it easy on you. Thank you. You gotta put some money on this? Yeah! I'm gonna put this in a way so not 